All of this kind of news daily is heavy. It's weighing on our minds day and night. Let's focus on night for a minute because how it weighs on us at night is in our sleep and in our dreams. Dr. Michael Howell studies sleep and his field of study is restless right now. When we're stressed out, we don't sleep well. And not only is the sleep not good, for some of us, the dreams aren't either. Dreams are just bringing up fears and frightening memories. And so it makes sense that coronavirus is the big fear that we're struggling with right now. So it makes a lot of sense that people would be having nightmares about it. So that's natural? It's totally natural, yes. What is happening is your mind is full of worry about everything the coronavirus could take from you. COVID-19 is circulating. Eight to 10 weeks of a national lockdown. Soon our hospitals are gonna be overwhelmed. And all of those thoughts are like files of information for your hard drive, your brain. So we go about our daily experience and we have all of these different, we're bombarded with all sorts of information. And right now it's mainly bad. At night, your brain is compressing those files to try to help your you make sense of them. And your brain isn't altogether rational when it compresses information because it's sorting not by specific worries, but by specific emotions. So if stress is what you hold in your body and your mind when you close your eyes, your body and your mind go find old stresses to replay in your dreams too. Stressful experiences in your life right now are gonna all of a sudden start coming back to the worst experiences you've had in your life, bad relationships, illnesses, loss. So, like the opposite of your greatest hits are getting pushed up there too with the pandemic? <laughs> Jana's worst hits. So how do we break the cycle and find sweet dreams? Start to create evening rituals that do not involve screens and do not involve the news. It's reported coronavirus cases. I think it's gonna go very good and very quickly. We are your future. I can't believe I'm saying it, but yeah, stay away from the news an hour before bed. Also make a routine. Get up at the same time every day and go to bed at the same time every day. Try and get some exercise and get some light first thing in the morning because folks, sleep is a super medicine not just a thing we do at night. What's one of the few things you can do to boost your immune system is sleep better.